In this video, we look at graphs which have a curve and a turning point. These are called parabolic caves. You will need to first watch the video on curved line graphs and grid reference by clicking the links provided. This video is made by MediaWorks, South Africa's foremost provider of adult education. Visit www.mediaworks.co.za for more information on our computer-assisted and face-to-face -face learning programs. This equation tells us the relationship between x and y. And to find the relationship, we are going to plot the numbers on a table. y is equal to x squared plus 3. The value of x in this case is minus 4. So minus 4 squared we are going to get 16 because minus 4 times minus 4, two negatives, are going to give us a positive. So we get 16. So 16 plus 3, we get our y value is 19. Minus 3 squared gives us 9. 9 plus 3, we get 12. Minus 2 squared, we get 4. 4 plus 3, we get 7. Minus 1 squared, our answer is 1. Plus 3, we get 4. 0 squared, it's 0. Plus 3, we get 3. 1 squared is 1. Plus 3, we get 4. 2 squared, it's 4. Plus 3, we get 7. And 3 squared plus 3, 9, and we get 12. 4 squared gives us 16. Plus 3, we get 19. So having these values, we are now going to plot our graph. When we look at the pattern of the numbers, of the variables we see that from here they are decreasing up to three then from three they are increasing again which means three is our turning point so we are going to plot our graph from that point so our x is zero and our y is three zero and three then when our x is one our y is four so that's the next point. When x is 2, y is 7. When x is 3, y is 12. Going on to the other side, when x is minus 1, y is 4. Our minus 1 and 4 then. When x is minus 2, y is 7. When x is minus 3, y is 12. So if we had all numbers on the number line, we would have our minus 4 and 19 up there. So we are going to draw our graph. So the equation showed a curved line graph. So here we have a parabola. 